Yo guys, welcome back to another video on our channel and today we're going to be taking a look at how to level up and unlock the OTS-9 SMG fast in Call of Duty Cold War and Call of Duty Warzone. Obviously the new OTS-9 has just dropped in the new Warzone mid-season update and I'm going to be showing you guys how you can unlock the new gun and how you can level it up super super fast within the game as well. So you can start using it in Warzone or whichever game mode you want with the right attachments on it and just start absolutely fragging out with this gun. But quick before we do jump into it guys, if you aren't around here, be sure to subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on so you don't miss any more videos on the channel. If you do enjoy it, please do smash big thumbs up and let me know your thoughts on this one in the comments below. So if I sound a little bit rough, it is literally 5 o'clock in the morning, I'm about 4 hours sleep. But you know, we're on the gritty grind, so we're here. I'm going to show you guys the best thing to do, but I'm going to jump straight into it right now. So guys, for some reason, actually when I come over to the classes, I've just noticed the SMG isn't actually even there. However, I know what the challenges are for the gun. And all you have to do to actually unlock the gun, guys, is get 15 double kills or 15 triple kills, quad kills, whatever it is. It's just basically 15 rapid kills with the gun, um, with an SMG. So just coming to Nuketown, one of the fastest ways to do this is coming into Nuketown or Rush or Hijacks, whichever game mode you like, whichever one's going to be nice and compact that you guys know you're going to be able to easily get double kills in. I sometimes like to play hardcore if I'm struggling on core just because it like gives you a little bit more time between the kills because obviously it's a one or two shot on hardcore. Rather than like up to 10 bullets and then up to 10 bullets again, it's one or two shot. It gives you a bit of a bigger break in between and then the second couple of kills as well. But so if you guys are trying to unlock this in Warzone, guys, obviously it's going to be a little bit more tricky, but what I would recommend is playing Plunder and just going to areas where you guys know a lot of people land. Like I know Storage Town is usually quite busy, Super is usually quite busy, and that sort of area in between and just outside of Storage. That area is usually pretty busy in a Plunder, so maybe go to that direction, try and get your double kills, and just be able to get this OTS-9 unlocked within the game. Obviously, as you guys can see, it is in the store. You can buy a version of it if you wanted to do that, just to level it up with some more attachments on it. You guys can go for that if that's what you want to do. However, if you don't want to do that, like I said, they are the fastest ways that you guys can unlock it. And then it comes to leveling the gun up. Obviously, when you get the new gun, you want to be able to unlock this thing as fast as you can and level up as fast as you can because you want the best attachments on it. And that's perfectly fair enough. So what you guys are, are going to want to do, again, if you are playing Cold War, make sure you're coming down, you're looking at your double weapon XP tokens. Chuck as many of these on as you need until the gun is fully max leveled up. And then, like I said, again, go into Rush 24-7 or Hijack and Nuke 24-7. Either of those playlists, because they're so quick, they're compact, there's going to be a lot of good game modes you're going to get a nice amount of kills in. And just do your very best with a gun that you possibly can. It doesn't matter how many kills you get. Obviously, the more kills you get, the better. The better the streaks you go on, the faster it's going to level up, because the XP is going to stack. If you guys see when you go on a streak, every time you do level it up, you're going to notice that it's going to be a one times, a two times, a three times. It's going to give you more XP. And this is both for player levels and weapon levels, guys. So bear that, bear that in mind, because if you are going into game modes and getting decent streaks, just playing it slower, getting decent streaks with a gun, you are going to find that it does level up a lot faster than if you're just getting one kill, two kill, and then dying, one kill, two kill, and dying. So make sure you are doing that. And then, guys, for those of you that don't have uh, Cold War again, and you want to go into Warzone and unlock this, I would highly, highly, highly recommend going into Plunder. Again, making sure you've got these double weapon XP tokens on just so that you get as much XP as you physically can from each and every gun. Um, and then what you guys want to do is go into Plunder, grab a helicopter from Spawn, and then just have the OTS-9 out in your hand at all times and just do supply runs, recons, scavengers. Every contract that you guys complete is going to give you a nice amount of XP towards the gun level and leveling the gun up. So make sure you're going in and doing... Supply runs are usually the best. They just seem to be so much faster. You can literally grab one, get to the next one, grab one, get to the next one. And if you're doing this with teammates, you can also get them in helicopters. And every time you're on a supply run, they can have the next one ready to go. They can go and do that one and you just swap roles and you can do it very, very efficiently and just be really on top of getting these supply runs done. Like I said, remember to have the gun in your hand that you want to be leveling up. This goes for any gun, guys, by the way, whichever gun you want to level up. But obviously, we're talking about the OTS. 9 today and how you can level up the OTS 9 super fast in a Cold War and Warzone. So what you guys are going to want to do, like I say, complete the supply runs, scavengers, recons, whatever it might be, but make sure you've got the OTS in your hand when you are completing them, because that's the gun that's going to get the XP at that point, so it's going to actually level up the gun nice and quickly. But hopefully this video has helped you out, guys. Nice and short one, just how you can unlock the new OTS 9 very fast in Cold War and Warzone, and just how you can also level up the new OTS fast in Cold War and Warzone as well. So hopefully it has helped you out, guys. If it has, be sure to smash a big thumbs up, as it really, really does help me out, guys, more than you can imagine. Subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on if you haven't already. We're nearly at 11k. If you can help us hit that, would be amazing. And let me know your thoughts on this OTS 9 in the comments below. Kind of hoping we're going to see the unlock challenges coming to Cold War at some point. They're in Warzone. 
but not Cold War. Not too sure why that is. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to be unlocking this gun, leveling it up, and all that good stuff over on my Twitch channel. Usually, guys, when I do this sort of method, it takes about an hour and a half, two hours maximum to completely max out an entire gun. So make sure you are following these tips because they are actually very useful and they are going to help you get the gun to max level nice and quickly. But hopefully, you have enjoyed the video, guys. If you guys want to check out my social medias, my other YouTube channels, or like I said, my Twitch link, all my social medias will be in the description. You guys can go and check them out for yourself. I'd really appreciate it if you go and check some of those out. Appreciate you watching this end. We'll catch you in the next one in a bit. Peace.